Hi, welcome back to Living to the Fullest. Today I have a really cute fall haul for my son. He is size 3T, most of the shoes are size 7. So, um, hope you guys enjoy watching this. This is gonna be a mix from several different stores. So let's go ahead and get into the haul. And um, today we're actually filming from my son's room. This is his um, dresser from when he was a baby, his changing table. Now it's just a full dresser. Um, some minimal decor right now. I'm still working on a kind of a theme for his room. Um, but I'm filming from his room because it just makes sense. So I hope you guys enjoy this fall haul. Um, some of the stores that I shopped at uh, primarily were Walmart, Gap.com, and OldNavy.com target.com um, and some I purchased in the store uh, as well as um, a couple of pairs of shoes from Kohl's and one pair of shoes from Dillard's so in general these are very affordable pieces and they are uh, interchangeable they mix and match with a lot of things he already has so similar to my spring haul I also buy colors that I know will match with things he already owns or easy to match up with jeans and things like that not too many graphics, although I did buy some with graphics, but in my mind, they're super minimal. Um, and so let's go ahead and get into the haul. So I started with um, the toddler section at Walmart, and they actually have just great selection and great modern looks to their clothes um, at really great prices. I mean, this shirt was $4.98, you know, brand new. And a lot of times, $4.98 is what you would pay at like a consignment shop. So if you want something brand new um, and affordable, Walmart's the way to go. This had a really cute logo. It says Brave and Strong. This is size 2T. They kind of run large. He's kind of going into 3T now, um, but I bought this shirt in 2T. And this was, um, this was kind of a pick for me for his fall photos as well at his um, photo shoot but I went with a different color I went with like a rusty shirt um but this will be cute to wear with some of the other items that he already has so again one uh, long sleeve shirt with a hood um 2t two, two for 4.98 and you can definitely layer have a t-shirt underneath it can be used as a sweatshirt or just a standalone sweater he had similar ones last year that were you know 18 month and up um this is just kind of another take on that one so I'm going to move this over to the side and in the same style with pockets in the front and a little hood um, is another one that's, um, I believe, the Garanimals brand. Also 2T. This is that rust color. And this one says, let the adventure begin. And I love that it has a little dinosaur because we're in that dinosaur phase right now. He loves dinosaur toys, dinosaur movies, everything dinosaur. So that was a win. And for $4.98... That was a great deal. Another great brand that Walmart carries is this one called um, Easy Peasy. And I bought a lot of like little infant clothes there. But they, even in 3T and up, all the way up to 5T, they have some really cute sets. And so if you were looking for a set and you like to be very matched up, um, this is a cute set that I got there. And each piece is only $10, as you can see. Sometimes these also go a little bit on sale or go clearance at the end of the season because I'm buying these in September kind of for fall and into winter um, They were not on sale, but they were at ten dollars a piece These are great and they look similar to more high-end brand names and again as little boys or girls outgrow their clothes so quickly I just don't see the sense in spending a lot of money on a set if you don't have to if you can find something just as cute just as durable and um comfortable for them to wear for a much lower price then i think you should go for it so that's what i'm trying to show you guys where to get the good deals and what are the good brands and where so easy peasy is a great one at walmart um if you don't find your size at that walmart try walmart.com or try to go to another walmart sometimes you'll find what you need at a different location so you know don't give up so that's a cute set a gray stripe with gray pants and again the gray this could still be worn with jeans this pair of pants could be worn with just a white top different kind of top or different sweater uh, now moving on to what i got at old navy these were also pretty i think i got them on sale so full price they were 
Um, let me see. It may not say the price, but they were somewhere... Full price, they may have been something like $9.99 or $8.99, but I got them on sale for like $5 each. So what I like about these is this minimal graphics, uh, but some graphics so that, you know, um, for children, they can be they can be excited about wearing a certain shirt. Like this one has a wolf, you know, they my son likes to see the animal and then say what the animal is when he's wearing it, like wolf or dinosaur or a tiger. So this one's cute. It says stay wild. Nothing on the back. This one says new places, new friends, alien. He's starting to watch some alien cartoons, so he he likes aliens. Then a little spaceship, and this one says having a blast. Again, the color scheme or tone of the shirt is still relatively neutral. You could wear this with beige um, uh, pants, like a khaki pant, jeans, because you got some blue in here. You can really wear it with any color pant. And same for shoes, too. Any kind of tan, dark brown, light brown shoe or pant would go well with this type of shirt for fall then over here this one has a little bear playing on a guitar but what i like about these shirts and these were popular in the 90s is you have a graphic on the back which is cute and this one also says stay wild like the first shirt so again super affordable and they were like four four or five dollars each after my sales codes and another great thing is that if you shop at Old Navy or Gap a lot, they give you something called Gap Cash or Old Navy Cash. So if you have enough, then you can use it. It's usually spend 50 and maybe get $20 off or spend 100, get $40 off, something like that. So if you wait till that sale or that coupon goes into effect, you'll save even more money. So another tip, most of you probably already know that, but just a reminder. Now at Target, I picked up these two pieces um, and just walking by and, and luckily they had his size and I thought in person these looked a lot cuter than on the website so I picked up this sweatshirt this is the Toy Story one and he's what he's been watching a lot of Toy Story uh, movies um, and getting into the characters and so I thought this would be really cute it's got prints on the back as well uh, what I love about it is this one is, is also very easy to match up you can have a layer of like a white tee underneath long, long sleeve or short sleeve but then you can match it up with something like this, like these jeans. Now, right now, these sort of more wide leg jeans are popular for kids also. I'm seeing these a lot more than um, than the skinny jean or even the bootcut jean. So these this is kind of semi-wide leg. And, um, well, it says relax straight, but on his legs, they, they're kind of wide. But that's the look right now. So with a kind of a baggy t-shirt like that and some jeans, this is kind of a lighter wash. And he did not have this shade so i got these in 3t and they're going to be a little big on him but he'll grow into them and again this is something that could carry him into the winter months and into next fall as well if he still fits into them and he probably will going with the disney theme i also got this pair this was from h and m i believe this mickey these mickey pants they may have been gap let me check <clears throat> oh yeah these are gap so they now do a lot of prints with Mickey. These I like because he's in gymnastics classes, so he needs some kind of a soft sweatpant that's easy to move around in. But going into winter months, you can't just wear shorts. So it's probably going to be chilly even indoors, So especially in a big gym. So I got him a pair of these, and maybe I'll pick up a few more. But I thought that was cute. And again, that would go really well with just some white sneakers and a white shirt. Very simple, but it's same cute, same time really cute, and Mickey is, you know, is the iconic character of Disney. So going with the Mickey theme too, Target.com, I ordered him this one. This is a set, and it's also in size 3T, 3T. And what I like about this, it's kind of got the old, you know, jersey logos, like a high school or college jersey got a print on the back really cute i love this color too it's like a mustard yellow but not too orangey and then with the pants it's got graphics on down the side of the pants so i'm going to show you how these look with sneakers that i got him so this was pretty this was 17 dollars for the set that's a really great deal for a disney uh for a disney uh brand 
Disney graphics, and you get two pieces for $17. Again, versatile, you can wear them separately or wear them together. And then he needed some pajamas too. So again, we're getting to Disney movies. Monsters Inc. is a popular one. And I got him, a, this is a set of two pajamas. Um, it's got this lime green one, then white with blue. And then these are the pants that go with them. Again, I think they can be mixed and matched. These are 3T. He does have four sets of pajamas, but two of them he's already outgrowing. And two of them are just uh, Christmas themed. So we're not going to wear them until Christmas because they're very, you know, Christmas trees and green and um, red and things like that. So somewhere in between those months, we can wear these Disney pajamas. So they're both long sleeve. The top is long sleeve. The bottom's too. I thought this was really cute. And... There are Target stores and Target.com and $18 for a set of two pajamas. So $9 per pajama. That's really cool for a Disney, for a Disney brand or a Disney graphic. Now moving into shoes. And yes, I do have a lot of shoes here to show you. I have five pairs to show you and he has even more that he's already wearing. But these are more specifically for fall and winter. Um, but what I want to bring out, mention, is that two of these are size 8. So he's really going to grow into these in the, the spring, and it'll last them into next winter. Um, if he's going to wear them this season, then I'm probably just going to put two pairs of socks on him for some of the bigger ones. Or just hold off until his foot grows. Um, taller boys tend to have growth spurts, and then, you know, one minute they're wearing one size, the next minute it doesn't fit them at all. So um, I think he's going through that right now and he's um, getting taller and I think his shoe size is going to switch really soon from size seven to size eight. So two of these pairs of shoes are size eight. So that's not really important, but that's kind of why I have five pairs for this season. Um, and I think they're kind of each still unique and you kind of need one type of each shoe. So here I have a more dressed up shoe for him. This is real leather and this is the one item here in my haul that I got at Dillard's. And the reason I got it is because this was marked at $70. And it was on clearance for $25. $25 is generally what you pay for a brand new shoe like a Target or Kohl's. So that was a great deal. Because I saw it on clearance, I decided to buy it. Real leather. This is a more dressed up shoe, but yet you could also wear it casually. But if you was to wear a suit or something like that, to a very formal occasion, maybe a Christmas dinner East or um, well, not Easter, but maybe some photographs with maybe a more formal jacket, button down shirt, something like that. These shoes would be great for that, for photos. That's kind of what I'm thinking. And because they're leather, they're going to be really durable, especially if he gets, if he wears them in the winter, even with some um, being out in the snow or just in the, in the, the way that the roads get dirty kind of in the November and December months, if you live in the area that snows. So, um, really happy with those. And so my tip there is you can go to high end stores, just go straight to the clearance rack or their sales rack or go on weeks where they have sales and you can get pretty great deals. Yes. You will be limited by the kind of, um, sizes that they might have. They may not always have your size of the shoe you like, but it's worth looking. Um, and if you can't go to the original store, then try to find the version of their outlet store or try to go to uh, outlet retails like, as I mentioned before, Marshalls, Ross, TJ Maxx, uh, Bel Belk Outlet, Bell's Outlet, things like that. And you'll get great deals on really high-end designer shoes. This brand is called Flag Limited. I've never really heard of this brand, but just from the quality of the shoe and its original price, I could tell that it was, it was great. This is a good deal. Here, these are about full price. These were from Target.com, but they are uh, Levi's brand. And I like the colors. They kind of look like a Tommy Hilfiger color scheme. You know, you got your classic dark blue, dark red, and white. It's got a little bit of tan. And I was just thinking this type of shoe, just a, like a basic flat white, not beige or cream, is great for outfits that go with jeans that have a lot of white in them with a classic white t-shirt, long sleeve shirt, white sweater, white sweatshirt, and um, with anything that kind of has blues or reds in it. So shirt like this would match that, you know, you could have, you could wear that with white pants, black pants, dark blue pants, or jeans. <clears throat> so this is outside of the warm toned uh, shoes and, and uh, clothing. So I thought that was a great pair to have. And these are size seven and they were $24.99 at Target. 
Again, if you don't find them in your local store, try their online um, inventory and see if you can find it there. These two pairs are really great because I bought these with Kohl's Cash. And now Kohl's Cash usually actually does not have you spend a minimum amount to use it. So if you've earned, let's say, $20 in Kohl's Cash, you can spend it without having to buy another item as long as it's uh, within the uh, brands that they approve. So this one, was, this is Cat and Jack. This is, actually, well, this one is Target brand. This one is Kohl's. So I bought this pair with Kohl's Cash. I had about $15 left, and these were also discounted to about $13.99 or $14.99. So I literally just paid out of pocket maybe $1. And I bought them online and then picked them up at the store. So if you choose that route, then you don't have to pay for shipping. You just go pick it up at your local store when it arrives. So that's another great trick and tip size eight these are rather big but i again these will carry him into the end months of february march of next year of 2025 and into next fall these look really great pretty durable again a classic color that will go with any of these kind of warm tone fall tones um, like a dark green a lot of green this light brown shirt and then whatever color pants uh, you'd want to use with them either uh, light tan jeans or dark brown so that was a great buy so i spent a dollar on those technically and this pair is cute this is cat jack from target i believe these were also some on sale somewhere between 15 and 20 dollars total size seven they do look very similar but the difference is is that these are one size higher so as soon as he outgrows these we'll move them into these okay and these are kind of light enough to still wear with summer things. Um, where I live, it's still in the high 80s and 90s. So I don't think we're going to get cool weather anytime soon. So he can still wear these with any of his beige and warm tone outfits that are still summery. Shorts, short sleeve shirts, things like that. So these pass for summer shoes too and for early spring. And then for the heavy winter months, I got him a pair of these. Their temperature um i would say temperature um controlled in the sense that your feet are not going to get super cold in these um this the, it'll retain the heat that that uh, produced from your body in these shoes and they're waterproof so i like both of those things especially if your children play outside and they want to be out in the snow and if the snow is slightly wet and melting you definitely want a shoe like this and uh, one that also goes high enough to where it they don't get any water in their socks as well. So you would tuck, tuck in their pants in here as well. These, these are size seven. And what I love is that they're $40 at Walmart. And usually something like this where um, they, <clears throat> they can be worn at negative 20 degrees Fahrenheit. And they're waterproof and pretty good quality. $40, I mean, I am, on Amazon, a lot of the higher end brands start at probably a hundred dollars for a pair like of shoes like this so again i don't see the sense of spending that much for just one season so forty dollars at walmart for me is the way to go and this matches a lot of his blue and um blue light blue jean outfits that he already has so i'm happy with that purchase and the last part of my haul is i wanted to show you some outfits that i bought for him last season that he still fits into and that will kind of go with everything here that i've purchased here that's new so he already had a pair of of these kind of um medium brown uh it's actually a jean but it's a stretchy jean so this is this would be great with again these warm tone kind of uh, outfits and he already also had a mid uh a mid wash color and a dark wash color jean so i did not and he still fits into them so i did not need to buy that many jeans i literally only just put one pair of jeans and one pair of sweatpants for him and again all of these will match with everything i bought with the shoes and with the tops he already has two hats from last year and they'll fit him this year as well this little cream colored beanie and then this one that you can actually tie so that it does not fall and um escape <laughs> let's put it that way but on a really cold snowy day this is the kind of hat that really covers well covers their ears so i would recommend having something like that if you do live in a pretty cold climate
And these jackets, I bought them last season, but he actually did not wear them. So this will be, because they were a little too big on him. And he also resisted them some of the time. So, um, anyway, he just didn't wear them. But they will fit him this year, this season. And this one is a 3T. Yep, that's why it didn't fit him. It was kind of a, a size too big for him last year. This one is from H&M. This is so cute. I love that the square, um, I guess, diamond the diamond kind of quill pattern on this so cute popular it's got pockets it zips up it's pretty thick here it's thicker lining than right here but they're both equally as warm this is um synthetic material um it's not down filled so i think this jacket was somewhere around 30 dollar mark h&m great option and right here it would go well with all of these warm tone colors now this blue jacket was from this is also 3t this one was from gap and this one is reversible so you can wear it with the bright blue or turn it inside out and wear it as a dark blue and i've seen other kids around town wearing the same type and it was it's kind of cute popular jacket again also it's got the stitching across it has pockets this one's very soft i think this one is down material it's so it's lighter but it keeps um, keeps the toddlers just as warm on the inside. And what I really love about it is that blue matches almost exactly to the light blue in this, in this boot. So that's a cute combo right there. Step back so you can see. So I hope you guys enjoyed this haul, got some ideas, especially where to buy things at a reasonable price or how to buy things at a reasonable price for your toddlers. Um, I know this is focused on boys, but all of these stores have same deals and same great selections for uh, girls as well. So I hope you guys are inspired and can see how you can uh, utilize mix and match from seasons before. And um, again, as I said in my spring haul, kind of buy based on what you already have and that your child might fit into already so that you don't have to buy as much each each time they outgrow um, a size. So after this haul, I'm actually planning on filming something about my own shopping. I bought some things for myself, both to wear at the office, both to, to wear to the gym, um, bought some new makeup. I just recently had a birthday. So every birthday I usually do, I'm like a mini haul for myself. So I've got some makeup and some other fun pro products that I bought. So I wanna share that with you guys. That'll be my next video. Um, and so until then, uh, please subscribe, like, leave me a comment, tell me what you liked about the video, um, tell me where you guys shop and what great deals you have. So um, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.